hard to believe looking at all these happy faces. Look at them, they're happy. They're happy. They're happy. But you know, but the world of rock and roll is not all fun and games. There's some like gloom and doom involved with it. I mean, some of the young people here actually have some complaints about rock and roll. Can you believe that? Oh, man. I can't believe that. I live. <laughs> yes. But some of them have volunteered to come out of the clubs, just tell us what's happening, what's wrong with rock and roll. First person, come up here and tell us what's wrong. Hi, I'm Liz, and what I really hate is when I wait in those long, long ticket lines for rock concerts. And, and I'm, I'm, sometimes I'm even stupid enough to wait two or three days for that ticket. But see, you know what the problem is? You just said it. You were stupid enough. <laughs> Who are you going to blame but yourself? Get a job. You'll have something to do with them three days. The thing is, once I get to that window, all the good seats are gone. So, even some of the decent ones are gone. You know why? You should have been there five days. <laughs> no, I'm sorry, but and then else you can do about it. Go watch TV. Get cable. Stay home. Get off the stage. <laughs> Rock and roll people. Next. Hi, my name is Dave. Yes. Uh, what I really hate about rock and roll is that those rock and roll guys are really good looking, and I get really jealous because I say, come on, Debbie, give me a little kiss. And she goes, no, 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 I want to watch Bon Jovi's Tush. I know what you say. Sometimes I go, and I can't tell, because they look so good. You know what? They wear makeup now. Girls like guys in makeup. That makes me mad, man. It makes me mad, I too. I know my little sister looks just like the guys in the rock and roll band, man. I understand. You got a good point there, man. Listen, Next time, no, don't I got, take her. No, no. David Lee Roth and Sting, I'm coming after you guys, so you better watch it. Oh, John, <laughs> John Hinckley Jr. here, Jack. <laughs> Next. <laughs> Hi, I'm Lisa. Uh, you know what's some bad? You know what really burns me up? Steps. <laughs> 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 no, seriously. No, but when you're a totally good fan <laughs> to the bands, yep. and you cannot get backstage passes. I mean, it really burns me up, and you guys, I expect one at the next concert, okay? You know what? If you want to get, like, backstage passes, wear some tight, tight leather pants, wear a little cutoff, and then walk by the guy. But what if I ever... <laughs> and you always get backstage. No, I've done that, and they still wouldn't let me back. They say, you got to have pass. Well, is your body in bad shape? No. <laughs> well, y'all just try harder. Wear a I shorter try. dress. I try. Wear no clothes. I guarantee. <laughs> You'll get a backstage pass. Stick it right on your thigh. Thanks, Watch man. the step down on the way down. <laughs> Next. Well, here's a hard rocker. What I hate about rock and roll is when you buy an album because of the hit single, and you hate all the other cuts on the album. You can't understand any of the words anyways. That's why they call it a hit single. There's only one that's worth buying. You knew that when you went in the store. It said single. It didn't say hit album, hit single. Cut that part off the album, take it up to the cash register and buy it. Save $4.55. Nice jacket. All right. Next. Hi, my name is James and Sinbad. I really like the rock concerts. I love all that head banging. You know, when they get into it, yeah. guitar smoking, drum sets kicking over. Yeah. I love it. I got to have some more of it. Bring it on. Long live rock and roll. <laughs> See, that's a man that cannot be helped. There's a few people who just walk the streets. He's been banged on the head one too many times. Rock and roll, rock and roll. See, I thought that was your hair. That's a knot. I'm sorry. <laughs> well, I'm glad you enjoyed it, man. That's the last rock and play for right now. I'm going to tell you this right now. I don't know what these people complain about. You're in the club. You're having a good time. What you need to do is go back in the club, quit complaining, bang your head on the wall, enjoy yourself, get rid of that raincoat. You have a good time. Don't just people make you mad, man. Next time, stay in the club. Party. <laughs> All right, dude. <laughs>